Hi boys and girls, it's time for math. And today we're going to talk about the number nine. I have two cards here in front of me. They both have nine. Do they look exactly the same? No, they don't. Now I can only hold one at a time. Let's see, I'm gonna have you look at this one. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That has nine. Let's try this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So they both have nine. How many are on this card now? I couldn't trick you. They still say nine, right? That's true. What if I hold it upside down? How many are on it? Nine. Very good. Well, let's look at this. I have a number bond here, and the big number is nine. Now, when I cover up these, what number do you see? Without counting, did you know it was a six? It looks just like the six on the dice, right? Three on one side, three on the other. Six, and how many am I hiding? Well, nine equals six, and did you know it was three? So that's a number pair that equals nine, six and three. Let's try it with the other card. We're still gonna have nine, right? But now look, what happens when I cover up that? How many do you see? Four on this side, four on that side. Do you know four plus four? That's right, you can see the eight. How many am I hiding? Just one. So what's the number pair? Eight and one make nine. Very good. Now, if you have your rods nearby, and you should, I know um, my children usually keep their rods in their toolbox. Oh, I'm so disheveled today. Well, I've got my, oh, here it is. So I have my toolbox right here and I have my rods inside. If you have your rods nearby, go ahead and take them out. I'm gonna to try to set this up here on this table. Oh, there we go. I hope you're all sitting at a table too. And we're going to take out the nine rod. What color is it? Yes, the nine rod is the blue rod. So ready? Get out the nine rod. Now remember, we said one and eight make nine. Can you do that with your rods? One, eight. Very good. And we can say all the equations, can't we? One plus eight equals nine. Or eight plus one equals nine. Or nine equals one plus eight. Or... 9 equals 8 plus 1. That's just like the number bond we did. 9, 1, and 8. Here it is. All right, well, what was the other one we did? We did 6, the dark green, and what? Go ahead and try. Can you remember or do you just know it? What number did I put there? 3 plus six equals nine, or six plus three equals nine, or nine equals three plus six, or nine equals six plus three. You can do it all those different ways. Now I'm gonna challenge you, are you ready? Take out your five rod. Nine, I'm gonna put it up here for you to see, nine, and I have the five here, what will go in that number bond? Remember what I was doing? And that fits. What number is the purple? That is the number four. Four and five make another number pair. You guys are doing great with this. All right, here's the challenge again. I still have my nine rod. What's another one we could do? Ooh, what if I do that? What number is that? That's the two, isn't it? 
So in my bond, I still have my nine. And here I'm going to put the two. What's the partner number for it? Use your rods to figure it out if you're not sure. What will fit? What is that black rod? Yes, that's the seven rod. Good job. Let's say this, the equations together. Two plus seven equals nine. Or seven plus two equals nine. Or nine equals seven plus two. Or nine equals two plus seven. You got it. We're going to keep working on these. The little numbers were a little bit easier, weren't they? But once you figure it out, you got it. And when you can't figure it out in your head, when you don't know it is mental math, you've got your rods. Well, today you're going to work on pages 76 and 77. And you're going to need a mom or dad next to you because they're going to read you the, the words because they were a little hard. Um, it says there are nine shirts. Wow. Let's check. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. There are. See, they put the nine in the number bond. And it says, color some of them with polka dots and the rest with stripes. Then they want you to make a number bond. How many polka dots? How many stripes? Did you do six polka dots? Then you must have had three stripes. You can do it. Now down here, they're going to keep reading. There are nine flowers. Color some yellow and the rest red. Fill in the number bond. So this is what you're going to do kind of on your own, but you're definitely going to need somebody to read it to you. Okay? You have that page, page 76 and page 77. It's still number bonds. It's still the number nine. So I think you've got this. And remind, remind mom or dad to have somebody send me a picture of your work because that's how I will know you got it all done. Have a great day, boys and girls. I'll see you tomorrow.